questions about how to do a PO for a load going to the galvanizer. There's nothing built into the system for that. Um, so anything we do here is, is a workaround. But I personally don't like the option of just attaching a load list to the PO. It, 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 get, it gets gone. It's a piece of paper. I'd rather have it in the system. Um, here's an option for you. Uh, may not work for everybody. Let me give you an option here. So I've got a load for the galvanizer right here. And which is already here. And I may have this one to ship. Yeah, it's, a sh it's shipped. But um, what you can do. So here's my list. If I go customize this grid. And let me put in here. Shape. I'm going to create a new layout here. So. I'm just going to call it PO layout and let's go shape, dimensions, grade, length, um, anything else you want here, obviously. Um, let's see, weight is there. So obviously pull over whatever you want there, whatever is needed, but you need to have the, um, at least the dimensions, the grade, the shape, all of that. So there we go. So now I've got a list of items, including the actual dimensions, grade, length, and all that jazz uh, to go on a PA. What I'm going to do now, I'm going to right click. I'm going to export to Excel. And I'm going to dump this out real quick. And there's my list. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to import this into a PA. You can do this very quickly. So I'm going to go file, import, and go purchase orders from Excel. Go grab that file. I'm going to import into a PO, and it's going to tell me some of these fields it doesn't need in the PO, so it's not going to import it, which is cool. So now I'm just going to say who I'm sending it to. Obviously, fill out whatever else here you need to, but save. And so everything came in. So now we'll bring this back up so I can kind of set them side by side so we can see everything. So there's my material on my shipping ticket. If I go over to my purchase order now and open AZZ Galvanizing Up, shout out to AZZ. Now I've got a list of everything that is on that shipping ticket. So let me just pull these side by side over here. So I've got the same list right there on my load that's on the PO. Takes a export import, but it's very quick to do. And now you've got a list on your PO there. So hope this helps. Um, definitely a workaround but it, it should suffice um, with, with the lack of anything else in the system, and that'll get your, um, all your pieces on your PO. Let me know if you've got any questions on this.